Hello everyone! In today's video, I'm going to demonstrate how to edit webinar videos. But before that, I want to talk about why you should edit webinar videos. Webinars are an excellent way to reach a large audience and share your expertise on a subject with others. However, the real value of webinars lies in their ability to be repurposed and used again and again. If you're hosting webinars regularly, you should consider editing the recordings of your webinars to create new content that could be used on your website, social media, or other platforms. Editing your webinar recordings can help you create new content. By editing your webinar recordings, you can create new content that can be used to attract new leads and customers. For multiple channels, you can break down your webinars into smaller segments, extract key points, or create highlight reels that showcase the most valuable information. By editing your webinar recordings, you can also repurpose the content for use on other platforms. You can turn your long webinars into snackable snips and post them on different social media platforms to gain more traffic. By editing your webinar recordings, you can also help your audience focus on your content. You can change the video layout to help keep your audience engaged and focused. You can also do that by adding subtitles and other text to help the audience be more engaging. Editing your webinar videos can help you to improve the quality of your content. You can remove any mistakes and meaningless parts and pause, and add additional visuals or graphics like background images and logos. By editing and polishing the recording, you can transform it from a dull and unengaging experience to a highly informative and engaging video. I will demonstrate this process in Vizard.ai, an online video editor designed for polishing and repurposing webinar videos. A cluttered video layout can also be a problem when watching webinar recordings. This can make it difficult to focus on the speaker or the content being presented. By editing the video layout, you can create a more streamlined and visually appealing experience for the viewer. With Vizard, you can click the Layout button and apply the layout with just one click. And you could also change the layout manually by drag and drop. And you could also design your iconic visual design by changing the background or adding subtitles and logos. Editing and polishing a webinar recording may seem like a daunting task, but with the right tools and techniques, it can be a simple and straightforward process. By taking the time to edit and polish the recording, you can improve the overall quality and create a more engaging and informative experience for your viewers. With Vizard.ai, you could easily edit the video by editing the text. That's right! You could trim and edit the video like editing Google Docs. The text will help you locate the highlighting clip quickly. The transcribed text is in the text editor you can select the part you want to cut off and press backspace on your keyboard, or click the delete button to cut them off. Then the corresponding video will be cut off also. For editing videos like webinars, conferences, interviews, or testimonials with a large amount of human voice, editing by text is a straightforward and efficient way. Another common issue with webinar recordings is a lack of subtitles or captions. This can make it difficult for people who don't want to turn on the speaker in public when they don't have headphones, or people who are hard of hearing, or speak a different language to follow along with the content. By adding subtitles or captions, you can make the recording more accessible to a wider audience. The text transcribed by Vizard has already been added to the video as subtitles. You could double-click to edit the subtitles, and in the Subtitled tab, you could easily design the style. You can always make up your own iconic brand style. Okay, these are a few basic steps for editing a webinar video. Those techniques are also applicable to online conference videos, online interview videos, podcast videos, and any Zoom footage. Thanks for watching! <music>